Uh, Ross got some toys out on these tables, you know, for Christmas. But there is absolutely nothing cool out here. Unfortunately, in the regular toy section, it's pretty much junk. You'd think being closer to Christmas, there'd be some really good stuff, but there is nothing. This is Thundercats Lizard Cannon with Lizard for $4.99. Oh, that's pretty good. Transformers Prime Dreadwing for $4.99. That's good if you don't have them yet. This Amazing Spider-Man comic series Glider Tech Green Goblin. That's also $4.99. Radio Shack. Looks like there's a whole new generation of X-Mods RC cars. Not as cool as the originals, but they're still pretty customizable. There's all kinds of parts you can get from. There's the uh, 124 scale ones as well as these larger 116 scale ones. There's this buggy. There's an upgrade kit for that one, the 4x4 truck conversion. It's pretty cool. Over here at Fias, I have those Halo Micro Ops sets. These are $7.99. Along with the Falcon, there's this high ground bunker. Pretty cool. Some Captain America figures, Thor figures, those are $5.99. Some Star Wars figures, those are $5.99 also. Got a ton of those amazing Spider-Man figures for $5.99 as well. Also these Men in Black 3 4 inch figure like the Lux packs, these are all $5.99. Agent J and Agent K, pretty cool. I got a ton of these Squinkies 2 packs. There's all kinds of them from Disney, Marvel, DC. I have these Moshi Monsters Mega Block sets for $3.99. It's really cool Ren and Stimpy figurine six pack. At a Christian store, I got this really cool Last Supper building set. It's got Jesus and all the apostles. That's actually now one of my most wanted toys right here. Dollar Tree, I don't have any Hot Wheels, but they got a ton of those Maisto fresh metal cars. There's actually quite a few cool ones here. And it's a convertible Beetle, that's nice. At Michael's, the craft store, if you're not familiar with it, got a whole section with model kits. And there are some pretty cool model kits over here. I even got some military ones. Quite a selection, plus they got all the paints and stuff, accessories as well. Some pretty cool fantasy figurines here. Check out all those monsters and dragons and stuff. And those characters, those are pretty cool. Lego City saved this Christmas book. I want that. At Target, they got this whole section with the 2014 Ninjago sets. Not sure if this is, I think this might be all of them. What's weird is it's in the women's clothing. They're in the regular Lego aisles. There is no other new 2014 stuff, at least not that I can see. There's some Hobbit Desolation of Smog sets. That's the only one I see, though. Nothing new in the Halo Mega Blocks. I don't think there's really anything in the action figures either. Still haven't seen the Black Series Boba Fett. Nothing else as far as superhero stuff. But BAM! Today is my lucky day. Yes! This is currently one of my most wanted figures. It's the uh, Power Rangers 20th Anniversary Mighty Morphin Dino Megazord figure. It's in the 6 inch scale if you're not familiar with these. These are kind of a continuation of the previous Retro Fire figures. They're nicely stylized and fully articulated. It's just awesome to get this.